Check this out, guys. I am under the bridge. Wow, look at that. Well, in uh, Udaipur or in Rajasthan in general, art is pretty prominent in their culture, in the Rajasthani culture, and uh, you can see that in their traditions, in their clothing, in their architecture. It's pretty prominent. And uh, I've also noticed a lot of uh, art shops in Udaipur that I've found interesting. There are people sculpting and making statues or paintings and stuff. And uh, there's a lot of those shops around here, especially near the market. So I thought I'd visit one of these shops and uh, talk to uh, one of the artists there and uh, learn a little bit more about their story and uh, you know about their life as an artist. So let's go do that. Check this out. So this is one of the street artists and he's Oh, it's so detailed. How long does it take to make one? One, one week. One week? Wow. And this is like the same one on the other side. No, she showed me the city palace. This one. Oh, yeah. She knew us in city palace and this one, lake palace. This is mountain. Right. From city palace, lake palace, and mountain. Oh, okay. So is this like a hanging painting or? Like because it has. Like a frame? <coughs> yeah. Then, uh, but this one on, is on the back? Or, or you do cut it? Cut it. Okay. okay. This is on silk, so just take out like that. Oh, okay. And what kind? Oh, is it? Silk. It's a silk. Lock, oh, yeah. wow. Painting on silk. It's really nice. And like this is you can see some more finish on it. Yeah. This is your shop? Yeah. Okay. I make here and I sell here. Okay. Let's check it out. I think all of these are his as well. Yeah, sure. Oh, should I take no, it up? No. Oh, it's okay. All right. This is the so all of these of are the yours. Marana from the city palace and right. the Gangor festival that one. Okay, when is that festival? It's in March. It's in March, okay. So Those one on paper, this is also my imagination. This one is on paper? Yeah. It's very detailed, it's really nice. One and a half month work, this one. This one? Yeah, this is wow. the imagine like how to look before Udaipur, that one. So this, this is what is Udaipur the used to look like before? Yeah. This is the wow. procession of the Maharana, this one, Jagdish Temple, City Palace. This is zoo, Gulaba, Rose Garden, that one. Oh, there used to be a zoo here? Yeah. And this is clock tower, fountain place we call for the Sahilio Kibadi, that one. Right, right. This is right. Chanpol Bridge, Monsoon Palace, Gangor Ghat, Lake Mon Mandir, Lake Palace, and Jat Mandir. Wow. And how much do you sell these for? This one, 35,000. 35,000, wow. Nice. Is that with the frame or? No, without. Without frame, just the paper. And what about the ones on the silk? This one, 2,500 rupees. Oh, okay. Price depends Why is this so price, much cheaper? Price depends on workmanship, because this is just like on only oh, okay. three or four days work. Yeah. Oh, yeah, this is a lot more simpler big, than big this work, one. Big yeah. work also, you know, <clears throat> big work, easy to paint. Yeah, and this is more complex and more yeah. details. Look at that, it's like, I had to paint every single individual in there. And what about these ones, the smaller ones? How do you, how much 1, do you sell? 1,500, something like that. Okay, are these like postcards or? No, the uh, postcard and uh, another one, this one. This big Okay. This is postcard. All right. These all are the same price, 100 rupees. 100 rupees? Yeah. Wow, these are very nice. And is it like an existing old, actual? Old postcard and new painting, that one. Oh, okay, so you paint over the old yeah. postcards. Wow. And what kind of paint and stuff do you Natural use? Color. Natural color. Natural color, but is it like? And 
Okay. 50% water and 50% gum to mix then make the color. Wow. It's very nice. I used to draw, but it's uh, I don't draw this good. You're very good. <laughs> uh, these are all 100 rupees yes. each? Yes. Okay. And uh, how long have you been, have you, this is your own shop? Yeah. And how long have you Here had this shop? 10 years. 10 years. And are you from no. Udaipur? I am from. Okay. I have had like 20, 20 years to start that. You've been doing this for yeah, 20 sure. years? Yeah. Okay. And when were you before? Bef 10 years before another place. Okay. Was it in Udaipur? In front Udaipur? of the Udaikoti. Okay. There I have a shop. Okay. Now so then you moved here? Okay. So why did you move here? Was it not good enough because there? Rent, rent is higher. There is, it's higher? Yeah. Okay. And are you renting this yeah. place? Or? Yeah. Okay. Nice. They have 25,000 rupees here. Here? Here. And how much were you paying there? No, there. There was 25 and how much? Here is less. Less. Okay. 15. 15. Oh, that's good. But did you have like a bigger shop they are, there? They are a big shop. Yeah, but here I'm sure. Small. Yeah, but it's good. It's in a good location and everything. So, and I'm sure you get a lot more tourists here compared to yeah. where you were. No, yeah. but they are mostly rich uh, people. They are group movement, you know. Yeah, the group so tourists groups, and they yeah. Are okay. So, do you have better business here, or was it yeah. better? Here is better. That's good. But now is the off season. Right now is the off season? Yeah. When is the season time? Season is starting uh, October. October? Yeah. Okay. From October to <laughs> March. To March, okay. Is that when the lake has the most water? Because right now it's very low? Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> well, I can't decide which one to pick because they're all so good. This is good for the gift. Yeah, yeah. And I have like this kind also. This is just like it. But I like to like, I have a lot of small ones that I have in my, like in my space. Okay. So I like to put them on the walls and like stuff. Like this kind also. This is yeah. my imaging. Is the elephant is good luck, horse for the power, camel for love, peacock for beauty, tiger for bravery, and cow for holy. Wow. Jaipur, Udaipur, Jaisalmer, India, Ranthambore, and Rajasthan. Oh, wow. And is this, this is also on this, sale? This one is silk. Okay. Like different colors also. Wow. And do you frame these up or how do you? No, frame also I have actually. Oh, it's so cool. I mean, look at all this. Oh yeah, this is the kind of frame. Yeah. That's really nice. Awesome. What do you think, guys? So, which one should I take? Wow, oh, these are all so good. <coughs> what is the name of your shop? So, if somebody. Yes, yes Art Store. Yes, Art Store? Okay. It's good. Yes, Art is good. Yes, Art School. So, you also teach art? Yeah. Okay, that's nice. So guys, if you are in Udaipur, come to Yash Art School and uh, you can buy some of these amazing paintings or you can even take some art classes from the master himself. All right. And what about these? Uh, I've seen people like making statues and stuff as well. Yeah. So is this, do you make them or do you get them? No, I, I get that one, then make the coloring. Okay, so you color them. Yeah. Okay. Nice. Like this kind also good as for Shiva and Parvati. Yeah. Well, is this uh, Arabic? Arabic. Oh. <laughs> what does it say? I don't know. You don't know. <laughs> 
Okay. So how did you like write this? No, this is the old paper and new painting. Oh, okay. This one. So you just made the painting yeah. it already had. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I could see it's like a print. <coughs> just like this one, 350 rupees. Okay. And is that paper? Yeah, this okay. is all paper, but less detail work here. Yeah, less work, so this one would cost more, right? Yeah. yeah. Nice. That's Buddha. Buddha. Krishna. He's Krishna. She's Mira, famous musician from Chitta. She's lover of the Krishna. So she's Krishna's lover? Yeah. She's a musician? Yeah. Okay. Uh, lions. It's really nice. And uh, you painted all of these as well? Yes. And how much do you sell these for? Like the step? <laughs> all are the different, different. Different like prices? This is the one piece for the lady. Yeah. 700 rupees. Okay. And, uh, is that musician is that, all are the seven? Okay, all of these are seven hundred. Yeah, and the ones each the one, one, each one. Yeah. <coughs> and what about these ones? The one here. The, those this. lady one thousand five hundred. Okay. So do you like purchase the statues and then? Then. Uh, okay. So do you buy them from, do you know somebody who makes them or Country, do you? Country, countryside people, they are make. Okay, so from the villages you get them. Okay. They are free. That's very nice. Oh, you have a really beautiful shop. And like this kind, the Krishna's also, Krishna's dancing. Wow, look at this one. What is this on? It's on cotton. On cotton? Yeah. Wow, it feels really nice. But it's very detailed. And how much are these ones? 12,000. 12, it's Most very nice. Less. It's really nice quality though. This, this is silk. Less. And uh, how long did it take? Like a month to yeah. do this one? <coughs> Very nice. But mostly uh, like my work, imagination work, it will be going like a one month, uh -huh. one and a half month. Like it takes at least a month to... And what is like the longest time you have spent on? Three months. Okay, three months? And uh, was it like a big, big no, thing? No, no, not big. Very small. It's a very small one? But That's interesting. So that one, we can't show you that painting because it's one of the most detailed and the most expensive ones that he has. It's, uh, it was done on, on plastic and it took three months to, to finish that painting, which is incredible. So, so you don't really get to see that, only I get to see that. So how much do you, like how many paintings and stuff do you sell in a day? In a day, no. No? Because like, there's nobody to bring the customer, you know. But you have a yeah. lot of art shops in Udaipur, so yeah. I would think that Udaipur a lot of people. Especially for the yeah, art. yeah. But a lot of artists, but, but yeah. Less, okay. yeah, yeah. But only mostly here the shops, you know, artists uh -huh. they can't make and sell directly for the tourists, you know. Okay. They just sell for the shopkeepers. Uh -huh. Then they are sell like a second time, third okay. time. Okay, okay. So and prices like, are going up. Yeah, know? yeah. If the direct artist, they sell. Yeah, the cheapest way is to get directly from the artist, and that's the best way to help yeah. the artist as well. Yeah. So yeah, mostly don't go to the art galleries. Just go to the artists themselves. And uh, I saw like a art gallery here, which is really fancy with the yeah. big. So they buy it from artists and then sell it yeah, from them. Yeah. Okay, so they don't have any artists there. No. Okay. They are just say uh, the make the stories, you know. It's the generation, yeah, yeah. generation we are making. Right, but right. Like yeah. Well, uh, it's really nice, and thank you very much for your time and thank showing you. me everything. And what about your art classes? Like, how much do you charge for? Like an art class. Like a three hour class. 
A one hour class? No, three hours. Three hours. Okay. In the three hour, like, yeah. you make uh, like those things. Yeah. Oh, like these yeah. on the postcards, yeah. And what is. Uh, yeah. 600 rupees it will be going. For three hours. Okay. That's not bad. And I have the cooking classes also. Oh, you also have cooking classes? At my home. Okay. Do you have a card for your for your shop? Oh, okay. So here's the here's the address and everything. And are you like on? Do you have any online uh, like on Instagram? No, nothing. Okay. Just for the WhatsApp. You just have WhatsApp, no other. Okay. Well, uh, all right. Thank you very much for your time. You have a nice day. Okay, that was incredible. I mean, there were so many different uh, types of paintings and so many like artworks and it was it was really hard to choose one. I mean, I, I wanted to buy more, but it's like, it's, it's really difficult to pick just one and go with that. But uh, yeah, if you are in Udaipur, it's Yosh Art School and uh, they paint on silk, marble, wood and paper and all kinds of stuff, so. They also have like art classes, which was pretty reasonable for a three hour class. It's only 600 bucks and you get to draw on your own old postcards and stuff, similar to the one that I bought. So in that class, you would be able to create your own artwork on the postcard and maybe you could start selling that. So he did say that he doesn't uh, sell a lot of paintings. It's, it's quite rare to sell some paintings, but so I just wanted to help him out a little bit. Uh, even though it was just a hundred bucks. Who knows, maybe I'll go back and check uh, one of the other ones. I really like the big ones that he had, but it was like way too expensive for me to just say yes on the spot. So yeah, if you are interested in artwork that looks like that, you could probably come and check that shop out. I'll add the details down and I have his card and everything. Unfortunately, he doesn't have any social media presence, but uh, I'll have his contact information up as well for you to check it out. So, so yeah, now it's uh, back to the hotel and uh, I'm gonna chill out. I don't think the sunset's gonna be, yeah, the sunset's not gonna be very impactful today, but yeah, maybe we could go chill out at the Gauts or something, I don't know. So that's all for this uh, experience from the art shop in Odaipur. And uh, now, yeah, back to the to the gods, and let's go chill out. <laughs>